true and blessed to be in the house of the Lord this morning. Thank you, Brother Green, for that selection and the Mount Island Mass Choir. And we thank you all for showing up this morning. We will be reading out of 2 Timothy, the fourth chapter, starting at the 16th verse. That will be 2 Timothy, the fourth chapter, starting at the 16th verse. At my first answer, no man stood with me, but all men forsook me. I pray, God, that it may be not laid to their charge, notwithstanding the Lord stood with me and strengthened me, that by me the preaching might be fully known and that all the Gentiles might hear. And I was delivered out of the mouth of the lion. And the Lord shall deliver me from every evil work and will preserve me unto his heavenly kingdom to whom be glory forever and ever. Amen. 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 With today being first Sunday, as we commemorate and celebrate the sacrificial death, burial, and resurrection of our Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, let us turn for our responsive reading to number 581 in the hymnal. 
and also 1 Corinthians chapter 11, amen, which is recorded in verse number 23 through 34. For I have received of the Lord, that which also I delivered unto you, that the Lord Jesus, the same night in which he was betrayed, took bread. Mm -hmm. And when he had given thanks, he prayed and said, After the same manner also he took the cup when he had supped, saying, This cup is the New Testament in my blood. This do ye as oft as ye drink it in remembrance of me. For as oft as ye eat this bread and drink this cup, ye shall the Lord's death till he comes. Wherefore, whosoever shall eat this bread and drink this cup of the Lord unworthily shall be guilty of the body and blood of the Lord. But the other man is not himself. For he that eateth and drinketh unworthily, eateth and drinketh damnation to himself, not the Son in the Lord's body. For it is called to many are weak and sickly among you, and many sleep. For we will judge ourselves, we should not be judged. But when we are judged, we are chastened of the Lord, that we should not be condemned with the world. Wherefore, my brethren, when ye come together to eat, tarry one for another together. And if any man hunger, let him eat at home, that ye come not together unto condemnation. And the rest will I set in order when I come. Amen. If you will. All right. Let's see
And all the people said amen. 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 After 139 years, we ought to be convinced, I would think. Y'all think so? Yes. I would be convinced, amen, that uh, God must be in this place. Amen. I mean, we, 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 I don't think that's some. Um, Around, I think, probably one well of them, 140 something, or somebody like that, 150 something. But this is our 139. Somebody will say that. We thank God. Uh, I told you, and I must, and I must uh, confess to, to uh, River Watson. I don't care what they say about you, little box. You're all right in my book. Amen. You're all right in my book. He said, he made a statement in a meeting that he and I were in, and he said, Pastor, it's kind of like stewardship. It just goes on and on and on and on. And he's right. Amen. Because I was going to finish up the summary with you today. You know, we start summarizing. The last nine weeks. Oh Lord, have mercy! You're right. Eight weeks to go home and home. Do y'all remember the last nine weeks? Yes, sir. Amen. 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 Yes, sir. Well, you know, I was going to go on to something else, but God said it needs to go on and on and on. Amen. So put them, if you had your notes from last week, then I stopped you off at Matthew chapter 25. But this is where we're going today. Then we'll go back. Amen. Sometime and pick up from there. All right? I want you to turn today to Acts chapter 17, verse 28. Acts chapter 17, verse 28. There's so many good things that are happening around us. Yeah. Amen. I want to commend the members of the NAACP. Amen. For a nice banquet last night. And for a good speaker. Some may they call him controversial. But he jerked the, he, so to speak, he jerked the cover off of us. Uh, Commissioner John Wiley Price was, he's never been known for being mild and choosing his word. He just goes on and says what he had to say. And he challenged us. Amen. And I want to commend uh, our uh, NAACP committee for choosing Brother J.C. White in his business. Now, he's here in our fellowship this morning. He and his lovely friend. It's just nice to be nice. And he was commended as the business person of the community and how he does uh, in giving back. And then also... Uh, the highlight for the press. Amen. I'm not on the press salary. <laughs> Somehow or another, the the press is on. But. I will say that if you didn't, because Brother Deloney, thank you, if you are very nice, the press in person is here. If you are one, <laughs> amen, uh, a veteran, as we said, then see Sister Wood, she may have those slips with her. If not, Brother Deloney is making out a list because we definitely want every Mount Olive veteran included in the paper. Amen. Amen. And if you don't have a subscription, then <laughs> Acts chapter 17 <laughs> verse 28. Son? Yes, sir. Thank you. Watch the right. Just keep going on. Yes, sir. Tell me what that says. <laughs> God 
bless you. The, the him and us factor. <coughs> him and us factor. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, uh, stewardship. Amen. <laughs> you know, really, truly, everything we do spiritually is about stewardship. Yeah, that's right. Discipleship is this stewardship. And this thing in our group is going to be, we're going to look at what's the best method to get. We all try to get to us a goal. And it doesn't bother, it's not how fast we get there. Yes, it is. It's getting there. Yes, it is. I'm not saying I'm going anywhere. If I do, the Lord just move. Amen. Amen. That doesn't mean anything about what you do. The main thing is, get a root, a pursuit, a method of pursuit, and then stay with it. Yeah, that's it, that's it, that's it. Now, him. There's a him back. Uh-huh. Have y'all thought about that? I know. There is a him factor in all of our lives. Yes, all of them. Yeah. I thank him. Amen. That sister the Lord, I texted her the other day and uh, congratulated her on the selection that they made. Amen. I told her they couldn't got they couldn't have got anyone any more deserved. Amen. 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 And right here in our community, for those of you don't who don't who do not know, uh, she's the new principal at Carlgrove Sue. Amen. 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 Right down Amen. the street. Amen. Oh, here we have, oh, here we have a Right. We have a partnership with uh, on every Wednesday, every Tuesday, amen, every Tuesday, uh, we pick up students from there and buy for our Odyssey program. Amen. Oh, which she was down the, she was the instrumental, and had the sister Lena, what did I put in? Formulated. Amen. Now, who would have known? Amen. 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 Yeah, we don't have to go to the press, but we, we can go to the press right there in the choir. Right? Somebody said amen. amen. And, you know, we're, we're blessed. Amen. We're blessed. I, 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 I want you to understand that we go around spending too much time on the us or you factor. Yes. Uh, that's it, that's it, that's it. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. You know a word I've never found in the Bible yet in any one of the tra uh, uh, translations? <coughs> and that is Felix. No, not at all. Not at all. Not at all. Yeah. I feel like yeah. And most of us, F-E, Felix. F-E-E-L-I-N-G-S. <laughs> and most of us, our lives are built around. Lord, have a boy in If you would have thought Luke or somebody would have written something about how we feel. I Yeah, 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 yeah
Notice what Paul says. I, I can't, I can't get off into the development. This makes number ten. Yeah, yeah. Y'all got yeah, yeah, it? Yeah, we'll, we'll come back later on. I'm gonna give a quiz out. <laughs> See how have you been keeping up? But notice what Paul, let me give you a little background because I'm, I'm sitting down at, 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 at 1230. I'm sitting down. Even if you didn't do your, you didn't set your old time, your clock back. I'm still sitting down at 1230. <laughs> Somebody would have to get on. Paul is on his second missionary journey. He's come down the coast of Greece, of oh, what is it? not Greece, yeah. Thessalonica, Avalonia, down to Corinth, no, Avalonia, Philippi, Thessalonica, Avalonia, then Athens. Several years ago, Sister Robinson and I got the opportunity to, to trace that second missionary journey. Yeah. We flew into to Athens, beautiful city, with all this history. The seat of, of, of the philosophers. Greece was known for its mental contemplations. You know. Great pursuers of knowledge. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The birthplace of medicine, am I right? Or uh, the formal medicine? Sister, Sister Dr. Brown? And Paul is there on Mars Hill. I got a chance to go to Mars Hill. Oh, I stood on Mars Hill. Hey, man. 2,000 some odd years later. <laughs> That's where he's standing. He's standing near in Mars Hill. And, 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 and Mars Hill is just a little ways off from the shrine. He's seen on his way through the city, statues, they got statues of everything. <laughs> oh yeah. They, 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 they were buried, he called it, superstitious. Uh -huh. yeah. I know somebody's watching say I got five minutes yet. <laughs> no. But he says, and I'll pick this up later, but he says, as he looked at one of those shrines, one of those statues and statuettes, he read an insigma, inscription rather, on it that said, to the unknown God. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Somebody oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Now you know what? I want to know my God. Well, y'all want to know it. And so he raised, he uses, now notice, I'm going to tell you something. Of all the times that Paul uh, ventured with people and, and preached and argued, this was probably one of Paul's greatest favorites yeah. there in Athens. He, he, never, he did not convince them that the gospel exceeded their wisdom of Oh, the Stoics and oh, yeah, yeah, Epicureans yeah, yeah. and the Socrates and yeah. all those. They felt that they had more going for them in that area. But notice what Paul said to them. He said, you know, this God that y'all say you don't know, he says, in him. My Lord. Uh -huh. My Lord. Somebody. My yeah. Lord. Yeah. 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 I want you to set your feelings aside. That's it. Right. And I want you to realize that everything that you even contemplate yes. is got the results from him. Oh, my Lord. Amen. That's it. That's it. The him factor. Yeah. The him factor is what allows you to get up and put yourself in the mirror and talk about how good you look. Fooling yourself. Somebody help me here. <laughs> he 
eventually I want to take each one of these things that we are in here, what it allows us to do. In him, we move. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, glory. In him. Yeah. And y'all, did y'all see that? That's, go back, go back. You, you, you've been, I mean, you know. You, and to watch, you know, we, we, we can get the running things by our familiarity with it. Yeah, yeah. See, we claim how healthy we are, how this we are, how that we are. You are nothing, and because it's all happening in yeah. it. In him. We move. This and I'm close. When I get up, before I get out of the bed, I got a little something that I learned from the deal. I tell God, thank you, See, I'm about to be a great grandpa. Y'all see Chelsea over there? Hey, I'm about to be a great grand. And you know, I'm just standing here thinking. Uh, see, we got we got little sister Aiken back there. We've been, hey, man, sister uh, Patsy. She's been to be a great grand. Amen again. So, hey, I'm doing all right. And it's all because I know who I am. Right. I'm in here. This lingering, whatever it is, Dr. Brad, I've been, I've been to your counterparts and got out a lot of this, that, and the other, but after so long, it goes and comes. You may have to fix me up a potion now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's just, you think, yeah, I, I was preaching down in uh, Atlanta, and I'm thinking I'm over it, and by the time I couldn't even get finished with, with the sermon, so. But I want to tell you this. Even if you took all of those three things behind the in him. Yes, sir. Put them aside. Can I get a witness? Amen. Then Paul said enough when he said in him. Can I get a witness? Can I have my seat? I'm going to take my seat. In him, we. Yeah. No, don't be you know, he didn't identify. He didn't say we Greek. Because he wasn't Greek. He didn't say we Israelites. Can I get a read? He didn't say we Romans. He didn't say we blacks. We white. He just said in him we. In him we. Who is the we? We all are in him. Can I get a witness? I'm glad to know I'm in him. There used to be a song that sang, they used to sing in the choir, Brother Green, and said, I'm glad that man didn't make me. If he does something outstanding, he'll just turn around and tell me, I just look that way. <laughs> In other words, I may not look like I got good sin, but I got good sin. I'm going to tell y'all something. I just look this way. <laughs> Oh, 